Howdy guys, in today's video of TrueCut RD Works, we're going to be looking at how to open your file or your TrueCut RD file within your laser cutter. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise back in the program here. Now just a quick reminder this is a mini series on um, the laser cut process and I will also leave relevant links in the description so you guys can follow along. Now just a disclaimer so I need to keep in mind this process may and spray will vary depending on the machine you are using. So, uh, yeah, I'll make sure that uh, you do reference back to your user manual or if you've gotten any training beforehand. So, uh, yeah, otherwise we're into this. So now what you want to do after we have done setting up the laser head position and height and also added the material and the lid is closed. Then we want to go to our little control panel on the actual laser machine. If I zoom in here, so in general, what you will find is some buttons. It should be perhaps, depending on your model, escape, enter, and file. Obviously, there will be other buttons as well. It's just the ones I'm highlighting, and they will by no means be in this position. This is just so you can see the difference. So now, in general, what you would want to do is you want to use your escape button to exit out of the previous menu you were in, and then um, press the file button. So what this will do is once you press the file button, it will load up the file we have uploaded or downloaded from our program. So, or at least it will go to the area of the file. So if you have multiple files, you'll be seeing multiple names in this area. And then just look at the file name that you named it to. Um, I, we did not cover that with the download option, but that's where you would name it. Keep your name ideally I think it was within eight characters, so no, nothing more. But I, I could be um, wrong with that. So in any case, so now what you want to do is you want to navigate with your arrow keys to the right file, select it, and then it should show you on the right here these basic settings, so your power and so forth. Um, it doesn't always, but some machines do allow that. Once you have your um, file selected, you can simply press Enter, and then it has loaded that file so now in many ways your machine is quite ready for cutting but not quite yet there's still a few safety um, uh, things we need to do in order to get this up and running but in the meanwhile if you guys head here to softwaretraining.co.za you will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover and also you can isolate your search here on the top right if you do not, however, find the files you, uh, or the, rather the videos you're looking for, just go here, request a training video, fill in the mini form, and then we'll do our best to make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching and cheers.